Hi, we're in Proctonica Fast Forward with Almit. We will have a short interview with Mr. Mendel. Clemens. Thank you, Denise. Hello, Mr. Mendel. Hello. Um, yeah, here at Elmet. Um, what is Elmet? We know Elmet, that's why we are here, but yeah. the viewer may not know Elmet. Can you please tell us a little bit about Elmet? The, what do you do as a company? Of course. Um, Almet is a global manufacturer of um, soldering material. We mainly produce uh, solder wire and solder paste. In total, approximately two and a half thousand uh, tons per year. Um, we produce uh, the products we are selling in Europe, we produce mainly in uh, Japan, in Tokyo. We have also productions in, uh, in uh, Shanghai, in uh, Bangkok, in uh, Korea. Um, but yeah, the most material we are selling here is coming from Japan. And our, our core components actually to develop flux. So uh, yeah, the, the important chemistry inside of the material, inside of the wire or inside of the paste um, is the flux and the flux is our core competence. Our viewers may know how to solder, etc. But the fact that you have a whole company, uh, quite a big company uh, looking at the stand, specializing in solder, that means that solder must be more than solder. So what is uh, so special about solder? Exactly. That's, uh, uh, soldering material is uh, maybe sometimes uh, very much underrated. Um, from the outside, uh, uh, soldering wheel, a uh, wire or a paste looks uh, the same. Every type looks the same. Even the competitor's product looks the same from the outside. But the important thing is the inside. Uh, as I just said, the flux is really important. Um, yeah, uh, you have so many possibilities to change the chemistry inside the flux. So um, the behavior of the uh, soldering material is completely different if you change additives, if you change uh, flux classifications. And uh, yeah, this is uh, actually what is also IMIT's competence uh, to develop really high quality flux and high quality products in the end. Um, metal is actually everywhere the same. If you have uh, the, the alloy of a paste or of a wire, uh, the alloy will be the same everywhere. You have tin, copper uh, and, uh, and silver inside maybe everywhere, but the flux is the really important. Yeah. Okay, and I looked at your website, and I thought saw that you have about uh, 44 different uh, references for uh, 6040 solder. Yes. Uh, so how do you choose uh, the right solder for the job? Yeah, this is uh, really a question from case to case. Um, when the customer comes to our booth, um, you have to know our products are mainly for really um, yeah. Uh, high demanding operations like industrial use, uh, automotive industry, um, uh, yeah, air, uh, aerospace industry, um, medical industry, so really uh, high demands. If you have, uh, for example, in automotive, if you have uh, products in the hood, a lot of vibration, a uh, lot of um, hot cold, hot cold, um, yeah, you need, um, yeah, you have very special demands on the product. And then we, we talk to the customer, what is uh, his main importance, uh, what are his process um, re responsibilities, and then we choose the right product from case to case. Um, of course, we try, um, we have new developments every year, and we try to uh, fit, uh, fit the developments to the market needs. Mm -hmm. um, we even try to uh, to figure out what are the needs in the future and develop the products already, not not uh, when they are already needed, but before that. Um, so yeah, we always try to yeah recommend our our most um, sufficient product. Yeah. And so, if you anticipate the future, do you also make a custom solder for clients who have special needs or custom flux? Um, for very special uh, applications, that is possible. We have done that already uh, for very special um, occasions. Um, yeah, we always remember very, uh, uh, we like to remember uh, in the 1980s when we had the NASA Space Shuttle uh, project. Um, also for that, we, we made some kind of a new development, uh, the KR-19 flux and this flux is uh, still used until today so we use it now for for other for other projects and um, yeah if if there's a customer who 
has really special needs um, and needs uh, own development, then we are open to do so. So it was Elmet Flux that made the Space Shuttle campaign a success? <laughs> yeah, if you want to do so. Unfortunately, the NASA Space Shuttle, like it was in 1980, uh, is not produced anymore, so the project is finished. But um, yeah, we, we took our part in that, yeah. So, personally, which is your favorite product? Well, that's very hard to tell. Uh, of course, I like more or less every product uh, from us. Um, but uh, right now, um, our latest development, our new MRNH paste, uh, where we are standing just before the uh, wall, uh, I like the most because um, yeah, it, it's setting a new industry standard. Um, if you know area ratio, area ratio, uh, people who use uh, SMD process, they, uh, they know what I'm talking about. If you have a, a very small pet and high, um, high stencil walls, you have a very small area ratio. And uh, the IPC standard says uh, it's only possible to solder with an area ratio over 0.6. And now we have developed a paste, uh, the MINH, that can solder down to an area ratio 0.43, which is uh, really amazing, which sets a new industry standard. Uh, and yeah, this I'm very proud of, and that's my favorite product at the moment, yeah. So, so here at the Productronica 2019, are you announcing a new product besides the MRNH paste? Um, besides the M I N H paste, we were, we don't um, yeah present a new product. Uh, we present all our our classics. As you mentioned, we have 43 different res uh, references, so there's a, a lot uh, to present actually. But yeah, besides of this M I N H, um, as I'm also responsible for the marketing in our company, yeah, I'm happy uh, to announce our very first customer magazine. Um, we will publish it. Um, from now on, twice a year. Um, yeah, it contains very interesting uh, information about new products. The MINH, for example, is presented in there. Also some classics uh, like our Gumix wire, which a lot of people know, is explained again, what are the highlights of Gumix. Um, we have a recap of the last exhibition SMT show in Nuremberg, uh, which is also explained in there. And what I like personally the most, um, we, um, yeah, we talk a little bit about our team. Uh, we have an interview with one of our um, employees who started their, uh, her uh, apprenticeship nine years ago in Ahmed, still works for us and is now responsible for, for all our uh, trainees and uh, apprentices. Uh, so yeah, that gives a little bit uh, personality in, inside the magazine and I really like it and um, I'm happy to develop it now uh, two, twice a year. Yeah. And I can subscribe to this magazine? It's uh, available for everybody? It's available for everybody. We, uh, we have just sent out, uh, uh, I think, 2,000 pieces to all our customers. Uh, we have it here at the big exhibition. You can also download it from our website. Um, and if you want to have it in a hard copy, uh, which I prefer, we are all online at the moment, but a little bit offline is also nice. You can uh, even uh, subscribe in our website uh, and then we send you a hard copy. This is also a very special wire. Uh, it's 0 0.15 uh, millimeter diameter. And you have to imagine inside of this uh, wire is still a flux core. And um, yeah, it's 100% it's guaranteed that on every millimeter of that wire is the flux core. So that's a very special wire. Um, I think on this, um, on this one, uh, 50 gram uh, reel, we have several kilometers wire on it. Uh, it's a very special, yeah. Great. As one of our sponsors, um, what is your general view about the startup competition? Well, um, st the the com fast forward competition is um, I really like. Um, fast forward is also some some uh, pioneer spirit. What we also write on our own flag. To be honest, uh, we want to be a pioneer in the industry, setting new developments. And uh, startups in general, I personally really like because uh, besides uh, working at IMIT, I founded two startups by myself actually. And um, yeah, so I'm really a, a fighter for the startup industry and uh, I like that, yeah. Can you share with us a bit of your planning for 2020? 
Um, yeah, I mean, in 2020, we will try to um, get our new paste even more in the market uh, to, to push the developments um, with very low area ratio because uh, we will have that problem more and more because, um, yeah, um, uh, sizes of, uh, of boards and, uh, and um, the mix on the board will be higher, uh, sizes will go down, so we will have small area ratio also in the future. And uh, voiding is a big problem. Uh, we are just in charge to, to develop a new anti-voiding paste. So I'm also yeah, uh, quite, uh, quite um, yeah, excited for this new development. Great. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure talking to you. Thank you. So we wish you a great success. Thank you. Thanks.